What is up, Straws? Today we are going to be playing the Chiha Short Gun. So, it is a low BR Japanese tank. It is essentially a heavy tank. I know it says medium tank, but I mean, its armor is actually pretty good. I just played a test match with it, and I mean, it balanced a lot of shells. But I mean, this thing only gets one type of shell. It is a HE. Yeah, it's almost three kilograms, so a pretty big shell for its BR. It can basically eviscerate anything that comes in front of it. Um, it should be a big, a lot of joy to play, and I look forward to it. It's like essentially, I would say, a low BR KV2. That's what I would compare this to. So let's try this little Japanese KV2. I think I'm gonna go see with this thing because it, it's honestly probably better in like closer combat. I don't see it being good at very long range because it has such a sharp drop off with the HE shell. So let's try to avoid the long, long distance as much as we can. Plus, we can tank shells pretty well. Like we don't need. We don't need distance in our favor. It is helpful, but I mean, it's not too important. But yeah, the boy's back in town, brother. Boy's back down, boy's back down. It's quite rare I can actually like focus up and like play. Each time I'm having to deal with stream yelling at me. It's new, just sitting here yapping myself. Give it a good old college try though. Oh, that's right. I always forget that you can't go all the way around on the side. You have to come in. It's like over here, it cut, you can't. It always annoys me. I always forget to turn here, honestly. All my hours in War Thunder, I still can't get it can't get the hang of it all right and all the other advantages i can shoot over things with this gun dang i was a little bit short there you see what i mean like i can aim a little bit higher and just get kids is he seriously still not moving how am i missing this horribly ah dude i think that's that third shot would have been it I'll get used to this gun eventually. Dude, that would've been sexy though. Honestly, that would've been pretty sexy. Yeah, here, a guy to the left. Yup, 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 yup. He took out my gunner, are you kidding me? Oh, why not shoot him first? There we go. Well, now I desperately need crew. Like I said, we can always survive one or two shots. Recently, I've not been using the auto drive. I've just been kind of steering myself. Like with holding W, I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. I don't know why I choose to torch myself. I hear a lot of close people, but I'm not going to be able to kill anyone. Do you think he noticed me? This is low BR. Do you think I can come up behind him? Don't usually do what I'm doing. I'm charging him blind, dude. You're kidding me. He still hasn't noticed me? What? It's like ring around the rosy right now. Oh yeah, for this thing being slow, like slow traverse speed, it turns really well. Like, this thing turns pretty quick for how big of a tank it is. So you might not have turret speed, but if you act like a like an SPG or a tank destroyer, this thing's pretty goaded. Stop there. Ugh. Gosh darn it. See, that's the problem there. Since I don't have a coax, I couldn't shoot that fence. That's exactly what I was saying about, like, there's a fence in your way, you're screwed, buddy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Will I catch on the barbed wire? Oh good, he's not paying attention. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Whatever, I'm making a run for it. I'm gonna run DCAP B. We need it. That's a lot of Artie. Please don't be teammate Artie. I mean, any Artie, but I mean, I'd hate to give someone a team kill. Dude, there's too many pins with that B for me to feel comfortable here. I've not tested this thing's reverse speed yet, but I mean, six kilometers isn't great, but it's not horrible. It's definitely been worse. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, okay. I, was, I don't know where that came from, but yeah, I do. Let's try. Let's try to run back at it. Yeah, I think I'm still gonna spawn on this side. I'm gonna run up here this time. I hear a tank somewhere. She don't sound friendly. I'm trying to keep my eyes scanning. It's not if it can be like a bunch of jump scares, dude. I hear to my left. Well, I was like stealing candy from a baby. Uh oh, yeah. Okay, I saw him. You just know that dude's gonna sit there and camp, though. I'm really tempted to shoot the dirt right there. <laughs> Told ya! Great thing about having this show. I knew he was an SU, too. Oh, he's probably punching the air. See, I was scared I was gonna shoot there, though, and he was just gonna pop out and ruin my day. Let's hide my original corpse. You really stayed here this whole time? You waited for me to come all the way back. Interesting. Five and one? I'm not even close to the top. Kind of surprising. 3700, pop off my man, good job. He has three captures too. Leave me alone. You know, pass, always just stay near buildings like this. 
Right here is not so cash money, but you get the idea. Yeah, they don't hardly really have any players left. They're all in the air. Uh oh. Ugh. Oh, he should have killed me. He whiffed. He really should have killed me. We take those. It's not a bad first game at all. It's like I took one practice game, played for like five minutes, died instantly. So for my second match ever with this tank, not too shabby. I know everyone goes C, but I'm in love with A. I'm sorry, you will not be able to change my mind. A is just mwah, cherry on top. All right, so right here, you can also get a lot of quick kills, but I want to move to more cover. Honestly, I might actually pop here for now because that's going to expose me on too many sides without more people helping me. Usually, though, I'd go to the right, but with no one on this side of the map, I feel like I need to take some more precautions than I usually would. But I don't know how good the depression is on this tank. That's kind of important to make this side work. Oh, I couldn't traverse quick enough. This is what I mean. Now I have a 10 second reload, which is quick for the 120 millimeter gun, but it's still not quick for this low BR. I mean, they get shots off so quick. I mean, enemies reloads on this BR is like less than a second usually. Oh, see what I did there? You reverse really hard and brings your barrel down. Trying to teach you all a little bit as we play. Got one. My gunner's down though. Cause I'm not repeaking that for a minute, bud. I see him. No, I cannot. Yes, I can. That was a hard miss. Okay, that was on me. That was a bad miss. Try to keep my eye over there. Ah, he killed him right as my shell hit him. That's tough. So he comes around so I can shoot over the hill. So again, HE. It's beautiful for that. Guys, I misclicked. Brought my mouse over. Oh, okay. I was I misclicked and didn't hold my um, free look key. So I really thought I messed up my shot. Rice he peaked, but nope. Still have it. That's a big bomb for 1.7, bud. All right, time to go back out. That's another suggestion. Always keep it in kilometers, dude. It's so much easier to do the quick math on where to shoot with kilometers. So I always just compare my range to that. Because you just divvy it by, like, 100. I don't know if that makes any sense. Like, so that's 300 meters away, 250. So I go to the 250 mark on my reticle right here. Where miles and, like, feet and all that. Oh, dude. You can't do that kind of quick math. Wait, I hear a dude up here. There we go. RIP L3, but I think I still hear another guy. What is that? Oh, I just killed the most overpowered tank in this entire game. That thing shreds at these BRs. Oh, I'm loving this. This reminds me of the KV2. It's just as broken, too. Just as broken as the KV2. I, I can sneak over this rock without falling off the cliff. Ugh. Barely. There we go. Well. That's that. We got it before I could even get there. Match number two in the books at seven. So six and seven. We got three heavy metal heroes. Wow. All right, so I'm going to head towards port here because I'm going to do better in the city than I am going to be sniping over here at A. I mean, I guess I could hide behind some rocks and drop bombs, but I'd rather just go ahead and just spawn over here. Oh, look, I even got a camo. I didn't even know that. Also, this makes sense to go over here with me. And here's a little fun fact for you boys. So this thing was actually made to defend naval bases. This thing was never meant to go tank on tank. So it makes sense I'm over here by the water. And you might be asking yourselves, why is this thing made to go against, you know, boats? It's because of its cannon. The cannon shoots, it's more like a depth charge, you could think, because it's made to go after, like, light um, boats and or submarines. So its huge HE shell would act as like a death charge and just blow up the water. And it was also kind of used for some light infantry support, but it really, its main purpose was to hold the harbor. I mean, all these that were ever captured were only ever in the harbor. I mean, I think it was used in battle once or twice for infantry, but it rare, rare accounts. Hello, I'm here to tell you about your car's extended warranty. Hold on, there's gonna be a guy coming up around here any second. I hear him whipping it. Oh, oh, get all the shots under that. Get out of there, get out of here, get out of there. It's like the one tank I don't want to see. Dang it. That's the one thing I can't deal with. 
I mean, I can kill it, but I have to get a really well placed shot. And where I'm at right now, nope, not happening. Dude, what it? I saw him in a bad place too. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, do you think I can do it? I was scared to shoot it because of the whatever was there. Might you might just be dead. There we go. I'm definitely dead. Hello, my friend. Wiggle. Wiggle. Oh yes. You're dead. No. Alright. I've lost all support. Alright, let's go on our revenge arc. Let's try again. I think I hear him. I'm just gonna pop in like Kool-Aid man. Try to help with the T28, because dude, he's dangerous. Did he just die? That's karma. I hate you. I hate you. I know it's a strong word, but I hate you. Is there another one? There is. We're going around for it. I'm not staying in there. I hit him on his underplate. That's wonderful. Uh, I'm not going to repeak that. Just smart maneuver right, right there. It's just not to repeak that. It's going through here. There's an enemy right here. There we go. I hear him. Yes, I know. I see his engine smoke there. Oh. Uh, you got to be kidding me. My gunner. Oh, no. Oh, it's also a D. Oh, no. I'm done for. Goodbye. I would have if I could have, dude. Well, Straws, we had a great start with this thing. I mean, I played one warm-up match I just kind of threw myself and died with. But then we had two really good matches, and we had a... Yeah, only three kills, but I mean, it's still a fun match. It was a high-intensity surrounded kind of vibe, but... This thing's actually a lot of fun. If you're gonna grind out low BR Japan, this is just the way to do it. This thing was so much fun to play. Just think of it as like a KV2 and you'll be fine. If you play it just like the KV2, you will be just fine. Um, but on that note, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you've stuck around this far, if you go over to my Twitch and look at my Twitch description, you can learn on how to win a free premium vehicle. I give free premium vehicle giveaways on my Twitch, so make sure to check that out. It'll be linked down in the description and or uh, a link will be on my YouTube homepage. But other than that, Strauss, I hope you guys have a blessed one. And peace.